combined even pre-patch right that's the main thing here oh uh -huh. that's not what Mixwell oh. wanted Patatex there luckily to give a bit of backup but does Meadow really want to try and challenge this he's toying Looks with the like idea he's practicing his squats there on the corner keeping himself <laughs> active and ready to take some shots if Patatech does swing around but he might not be ready for that flash that was being lined up only for a moment just in case Patatech needed support but they decide to back off and hold off in the 4v4 a passive approach by G2. Now, they know they've removed the smokes from play. Again, that's a very important part of FBX's game plan. The fact that they cannot now just fast smoke down and execute this site means that G2 can feel that little bit more comfortable with passive play. Yeah, G2, they're setting up ready for it. The push cards come in. The Fun Plus Phoenix, they need to find this action. A shorty in the hand of David P. He's hoping someone wants to push into lamps, but no one's challenged him just yet. He might have to go and hunt for the kills himself. And that's never ideal, depending on the distance that shorty may have to fight from. Look at him go for it. Oh, David P. Shorty Papau in their face. Now it puts it into the 3v2, but Meadow, he wants to stand strong. He doesn't have much health to fight with here, and David P is certainly on the hunt. Zipan's going to have to be putting in a massive amount of work, but he's backed up there. G2, they're pushing on forward, and Zipan couldn't hold on for much longer. The camera is only going to help him so much. It's easily going to be found and spotted out. We'll get an extra bit of information here, but this is a lot to ask for from Meadow. And Piff. He manages to make it work. My God, today, what he's delivered for us has been incredible. Yeah, uh, the whole day long, he has just been fragging out. He's always seizing the control. As you said, we see it a lot going in for the old door, but as they go back in for bathroom control, Patatex waiting there for him, and he flushes those smokes right down the drain yet again. As, oh, this sneaky little angle by David B catches yet another, and this is looking like a nice little shutdown by G2. A round that they should be winning, of course. But one that they're doing quite convincingly, considering the upgrade. With that one, David P jumping around. Could have lost his head if he wasn't careful. He's going to get up close and personal underneath the Cypher Cave. The Shadow trying to work his way through. It's going to force away the Sober for now. Oh, great work from David P. Him and Mixwell. The double team. The communication. It's on point. FPX, they are getting shot out of this round despite the lesser weaponry from G2. That's the huge thing here. It's like there's no access. Shadow eventually picks up one at least, but these weaker weapons are indeed just shredding FPX. That was such a great play as well. Meadow, okay, good. One kill. Needs a couple more, though, and they've got to all be headshots. Whereas HP is going to be slowly eroded. Oh, oh my god! Hello. What was that shot to mix well? Now it's doable. This is possible. Spikes down in hookah. He can go all the way around and get it, but he doesn't know where these Not players fine. are, and that's the Not problem. Not enough time. Yeah. Oh, what a shame for Meadow. Real nice shot into Mixwell, though. That's something to scream and shout about, but that's it. Zero. And G2 have looked very comfortable thus far. They've been massively pressured. Had a check. Trying to hold on to bathroom zero. He's able to tap away and do a bit of damage, but that's all. Oh, no, Mixwell! He didn't expect Zipan to be there. He wasn't even looking towards that. Luckily, he's able to escape. And Palatek, he's staying alive for now and gets onto the second. Beautiful stuff. But Zipan will eventually put an end to it. But that's all he's going to be able to do because G2 have got a massive lead once again. Meta this turn is in. No, no, I remember what you're talking about. We, we commented about it quite a lot of times. Oh, no. Oh no, what is going on here? Paratek hasn't been checked. Zipan went full force, full forward. They cost a couple of teammates their lives, but Mixwell, he's trying to be sneaky, and Meadow may have opened up a gap in this round for them to find success. David P trying to find his way in. Piff's looking towards bathrooms, knowing there's still going to be a player hanging about. But David P is not done yet. The Rolling Thunder strikes. He's going to go on the hunt. He wants to put an end to it. He's not risking it. The Flash comes out as well. Oh, Shao can't save his teammate. But it's still the 2v2 with the spike being down. And that's the angle. Piff and Arn is at the same. Quite found the kill off the back of that. And now we look at bathroom control. This is FPX. It's at the moment, but Meadow, he couldn't be traded on because the... Oh, oh well, no. Angel finds it eventually. That was the best option for Palatech. It's just very unfortunate. Xiao trying to find some success with the Hunter's Fury, but it's not going to work out. It's Angel. He's doing everything he can for his team in this round. But is it even going to be enough? Because G2... 
They bounce back out of worse situations than this, and Mixwell through the smoke finds Shao looking for more. Misses one, but nearly gets away with a second. Angel is just a solo fragger here, and he now needs to clutch this round out, but Artis proves too strong. And it continues to go the way of G2. They've reset themselves. They've come back with full force and full focus. Well, 6-0 to zero is definitely full force for G2. They are not given an inch to FPX. This is just sheer punishment. But uh, yeah, when you look at FPX's approach, they are only on pistols. There's not a whole lot you expect. But look at that damage straight away. Artis is lit down heavily. He, he spots out. Miss. He sees no one's there. Okay, so these players have uh, backed off. And there's probably only one or two of them around this area. David P spots out the second, taking down Shadow. There's something else to work around because they've dropped the spike. And Dave, he wants to maintain control, but he only gets the, himself the second before falling. And so a four versus three emerges. With Artis still so low, this could get dangerous. Certainly doable here. It's all on whether Artis can hold on to it. The smoke's going to be deployed. The push out comes through. Zipan low on health, and he tries to throw the grenade out. But Artis looking to challenge from start to finish. Because of it. Look at the slow play from FPX. You can't even get on the site with this, surely. Mix was just waiting. He's going to wait to hear it go down. Oh, but he can't make it work. But it's Panatek and David P who are going to make it impossible. Two players backed away in lamps. Mix was working his way over with the operator. How much ground are they going to give to these players? Zip has fallen straight away. Oh, and it's just domination from Piff. He's up in it, large and in charge. Paratek there to get the refrag in, and it's no problem at all. The spike doesn't even get close. Angel in the back line is catching a flank, but like with the Vandal, he should be the one up charge. He should be the one helping his teammates out. It's again, I'm not a fan of him not entering. Come on. This I would be too. 9-0 up, and you're, you're basically just showing, right, that whatever you can do FPX, even on our map pick, we can do better, and we can do better by a hell of a lot right now. Thanks, Artis and Mixwell have four kills each. Don't even need to play the game, do they? Just let the teammates do it. No, they haven't logged Look in Look at today. these flashes! <laughs> <laughs> Forever <laughs> blind. Oh, they're popping out. Well, he's going to get a few more kills now for his money. Charming in with some success. Can he deal away with Shao on the last bullet? It's all going in favor of G2 right now. <laughs> Those flashes. Flash, 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 flash. Okay, now we'll fight. <laughs> it's like all six get chucked out before they actually fight. No. I've, Google has decided I was speaking to it for some reason. It likes that they weren't even here. <laughs> Artists well, showed up. It but Mixwell well having magic moments on a set, and that didn't lead to anything, right? Yeah. Oh, wow, Padatech. Angel caught slipping. Straight slipping. Far too focused on everything else around him. Zipan's fallen as well, and Mixwell, it's just the whole of G2. Whenever kills can go their way, it certainly is. I'll trip the wire, actually. We'll get a little bit more progress before it does. Nope. Coming right back out. They destroy it though, start to move forward. Now the rotates are on, on the way after that trip bar got the lead and made through. Oh no, it's the ult instead. Gotta be careful over towards elbow. Patatek down. That's a good start. The ult's being used as well. He isn't able to get any kills on the board for him. Piff's working his way around, but will he expect it? He does some noise. Sorry to spam it away. We'll be able to back away. Four flashes coming out towards him, but the rest of his team are putting in the work that they need. Shadow may have got one cool, but in the way. A few players tagging up Mixwell there, but Xiao is going to start off strong. This is exactly what FPX needs, but can they move on it? Angel coming from the side. He's moved around elbow. This could be their chance. It's exactly what they need. Oh, but Mixwell up close and personal, but he needs a hell of a lot more than that. FPX, they've got the numbers. They've got the control. They just need to find the final two players. Both have full health. And G2 aren't going to make it happen. The pistol round goes to FBX. They're not going down without a fight. And they had to win that round. They have to win every single game. Full force push through. They're going to go through the teleport and potentially. No, they're going to continue on round to the A site. They're not getting the kills, but they might try and get the spike down. Look at this. This is a, this is a crazy run around. We're just pushing into spawn by the looks of it. All right. <laughs> I'm, I'm confused by the attempt here, G2. It's very unorthodox, but you know, it's working. 
I'm not even going to check they're still in play. I, that's a dangerous game. I mean, you cannot play for... Uh, whoa! Ooh, hello, hello, Shadow. Hello. He's hacked up Mixor quite heavily as well. Nice work from him. The grenade's coming out from Zipan. But still, G2, they're trying to win it out. Oh, wow. Shadow. Back in full form and full force. Is it going to be enough, though? Two players left to find. Padatek's pretty damn low. <laughs> you can't catch a break. Shadow single-handedly wrecking him as much. Left alive at the end of the... Uh, can't rely on just winning a round. you got to win it convincingly so you can do the next one and the next one. And this is it. I mean, the opening duels so far have been very convincing. Granted, they're not up against the best of buys, but still... And the thing is, it's just one yeah, wrong mistake from FPX that's going to cost mm -hmm. them, right? If you over-rotate, you get too aggressive into a few pistols or something crazy. It's just, you can't, it cannot happen. It needs to be played flawlessly, and that pressure's on your shoulders the whole time throughout this game. Oh, Mixwell. He's dashed on in. They're not sure where he is. Zipan is able to stay alive. He's able to get a kill in here, but this is very scary for them to deal with. Zipan's in the back lines, but there's players all around him. The recon's going to go up. The Sova ult's coming in play as well, but G2, could they potentially do in this off the back of pistols? Surely not. The spike's going to go down, and Shao, he's an incredible young man, but he's got a lot to do in this round. If it's quite low, he's able to get the kill to David. Peace! Oh! Lose 13-4, then 13-3, and every step of the way, right back up to a 12-12 scoreline. You can have that in your head, you know? Okay, we're, we're going to lose everything. Oh, everything was wrong. But if you manage to make that comeback, yeah, it's just one half. Oh, the ult's going to be popped. He's going to full force into this one with the weapons in the hands. Oh, Piff! That is huge! The missed shot with the operator. Then he slaps a couple of them around. But Zipan looking to pop the ult. They would have heard it. Would have known what's going on. Meadow's there for backup. Two deadly players left on the FBX side. But Panatek is ready and waiting for it. All on Meadow. Another 1vx situation for FPX to deal with to stay alive. Could it be too much? He's checking all.